pristine natural beauty, mesmerizing landscape, and the richness of the varied wildlife makes natural habitat of India a blissful paradise. From the canopy of the forest to the floor of the jungles and into the depth of water bodies, the natural paradise offers unique richness of wildlife. But this will all change if we do not change our attitude and outlook towards wildlife and forest conservation. As horizontal space pushes the city life into the tailspin of traffic jams, the vertical city moves towards jungles, disrupting the natural habitat. The tiger sitting in its jacuzzi is angry because its water has become polluted and his favorite pond is drying. Due to extensive heat, the forest is under the dry spell and rivers and ponds are on the verge of drying. The tiger will have no option but to march towards human habitat to find water and food. Due to conflict between civilized human beings and uncivilized tiger, the tiger loses life. The debate on animal rights begins. Why was tiger killed? And why tigers are important? And after a lot of discussion, killing of tiger will fade out of a memory. Like tigers, Asiatic lions in Gujarat are also important for maintaining the ecological balance in the wild. From a distance, everything in the forest looks calm and settled, but looking at the hyena pacing through the forest, it looks like scavengers are on the job and taking good care of keeping the floor of the forest neat and clean. Jekal has just grabbed a piece of meal and is pacing up and down to have its meal in peace, but crows are challenging his authority. Scavengers like Jekal play an important role in the food chain. They keep an ecosystem free of bodies of dead animals, providing a balm to the safety and security of other animals by breaking down organic material and recycle it into the ecosystem as nutrients. The sloth bear after enjoying the sumptuous meal during magnificent spring season is finding it hard to adjust to the scorching summer sun. The scarcity of water resources during the peak season makes these sloth bears lazy and clumsy. Time pushes the wild animals towards human habitat risking their life. It is time to think about how a natural habitat can be preserved and conserved. Indian national bird, the peacock, is feeling the heat and migrating towards human habitat as water gets dearer in the forest. During the summer season, most of the animals live on the edge of the forest to quench their thirst.
in the canopy of the forest, the monkeys and langurs are busy with daily action packed food search. After a good foodie season, they get busy with grooming. The monkeys and langurs may be the rulers of the forest canopies but are also facing a lot of problems as human civilization moves into their territory. Many of them lose their little ones as they fail to negotiate the hurdles which human beings create. Human beings' presence in the forest areas is affecting their lifestyle and increasing their stress level. The grazing of livestock in the forest is also leading to conflict between wild animals and human beings due to scarcity of space. The animals living in mountains were considered to be safe, but as more land is required for agriculture, the forest land is being converted into cultivated land. The felling of trees and tourists rush in most of the hill station is upsetting the ecological balance in mountains. From the tropical to the alpine area, the hilly terrain has the best and varied landscape and ecology which is the reason for the thriving wildlife. The silver peasant is busy looking for its breakfast, it flatters wing and gets busy with its daily routine. Early morning is the best time to catch a sight of Himalayan bear in the alpine forest of India. Bears try to grab an early meal in the morning and by afternoon they become lazy and sit in a cool place to enjoy siesta time. The barking deer after having a perfect meal is taking a quick fresh water break. Lion tail monkeys which fall in the category of 25 most endangered animals are living in peace. With continuous efforts and habitat protection, the number of lion tail monkeys have improved. Nearly 3000 of them live in the wild but they are not still out of the woods. Government of India notified an act in 1980 which is called Forest Conservation Act 1980. So all the developmental works uh, which are like uh, uh, which requires a forest stand has to make a proposal and send it to the Government of India for their approval so that uh, like any area is any forest area is not able to the developmental activities. So this act is very helpful in reducing or checking the deforestation. Dead animals are dumped near the water bodies due to which water becomes contaminated. It becomes a health hazard for animals and human beings. In India, Water contamination has become a major cause of concern as scavengers like Hurial and crocodiles were pushed on the brink of extinction. More than a million people in India get infected by water contamination which could easily be avoided by reintroducing water scavengers like crocodiles and gharyas in the wild. Forests next to rivers and streams act as living filters by absorbing sediments and storing and transforming, reducing nitrogen concentration by up to 90% and phosphorus by as much as 50%. Turtles and frogs 
are endemic to the western ghats of south western india water becomes turtles help in keeping the ponds and water bodies clean the frogs also play an important role in keeping the natural habitat healthy insects are crucial components of ecosystem where they perform many important functions they aerate the soil pollinate blossoms and control insects and plant pests as decomposers insect also create top soil the nutrient rich layer of soil that helps plants grow nature has many unsung heroes of recycling on the ground the ants play an important role in keeping the forest ground clean white ants play an important part in decomposition process of dead trees decomposition and decay are vital processes in nature playing an essential role in the breakdown of organic matter recycling it and making it available again for new organism to utilize the birds also play an important role in the food chain they help in keeping the habitat neat and clean water birds help in keeping the water clean they also help in keeping a check on the population of fishes and marine life according to one popular estimate some 27000 plants and animal species become extinct each year due to human driven activities human beings are responsible to the coming generation to leave as an inheritance and unspoiled world with intact living beauty and richness the people will dictate the future course of all known life in the universe if we can convince the people to preserve and conserve the natural habitat then only we can preserve the paradise earth otherwise the paradise will be lost forever and ever